is. I, you know, I have a canned um, response that, I, that I've been giving for weeks and weeks and weeks, but I want to move off that altogether, and um, I can't think of going to kill me for this, but I think it's really important. I have learned over the last many weeks that have been out here that our city school board members are great people. They are amazing people. They are public servants. They're working very hard. I make no bones about that. I know how hard they work week after week, month after month, year after year. I have been a parent in the Southside schools for the last eight years, and those schools have not gotten better. This is not about our city school board members. This is about the outcome of our schools themselves. I've been in those schools. I've worked with those children week after week after week. I've brought mentors into those schools, I've talked to the parents, I've met with the community, I understand the dynamics of those problems better than most people, I think, except perhaps Renee, because um, I didn't grow up here, but I, and I came here to teach in a college and live and not do this. I did not come here to be a school board member, but when I saw what was happening in our schools, I got involved and I became a volunteer and I made it my, my life mission to deal with this. We cannot accept the level of, 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 of education, the low level of education that we have in our low achieving schools. It is unacceptable. We cannot let it happen for another year. It's that simple. This is not about board members not trying or being well-meaning. This is about failing. We cannot fail any longer on this. We owe it to these kids. We owe it to these kids. I see them go through third grade and get discouraged and not want to continue with school. No child should have that happen. I believe this in my heart of hearts. We cannot stand by another year and allow these schools to fail our children. We owe it to these kids. We owe it to their parents. And we owe it to the future. It demands it. Thank you very much.